Procter & Gamble announced they're acquiring the consumer health business of German drug maker Merck for $4.2 billion. Economic expert Michael Jones says that the move could help boost P&G's falling stock prices. The stock price is down about 15 percent. Uh, right now it's around $75, down from a high of over $90 just a few months ago. And so this is, is one potential way of trying to invigorate that stock price. The products will include things like vitamins and healthcare products, but that's not all this company could do for P&G. It also gives them exposure to other markets in Latin America and Asia. So these products that they're acquiring uh, have been very successful in those markets. Jones says that the acquisition appears to resemble some of the influence that new P&G board member Nelson Peltz brings to the company. When Nelson Peltz joined the board, it was, it was kind of interesting to see that, that now they now started to acquire companies again after selling off about 100 brands. D&G employs about 10,000 people in greater Cincinnati, so will this purchase bring more employees to the area? I think more importantly, it, it stabilizes that workforce. P&G has been shedding jobs. Uh, their workforce globally has been down, and they've even uh, shed some jobs here locally. So I think encouragingly for the local workforce, uh, when P&G is investing in, in growth strategies, uh, provides a little bit of, of job protection for those local employees. Downtown Megan Mitchell, WLWT News 5.